tried to have a little bit of fun. <laughs> but we kept it under 70, right? <laughs> kept it under 70. What's up, my man? What's going on? That was, that was fun. How are you? That was fun. Yeah. I, I don't know what kind of power you're pushing. You're probably a little bit lighter than me, but we make about 600 horsepower. Really? Yeah. Okay, this only, off the bottle, this makes 470 wheel and 450 foot-pounds of torque. And then on the bottle, it has a 400 shot, and it makes 835 horsepower, 850 <laughs> foot-pounds of torque. You, you weren't spraying, were you? No. I didn't think so. No, I'll just, see it in the exhaust. I didn't. I didn't think you were spraying, but yeah, I mean, yeah, you you no. pulled you pulled from me hard. Yeah, I'm I also 5,500 pounds though. Yeah, I don't even have the bottle. <laughs> so, yeah, see, there's, there's the bottle hookup. But uh, no, I just uh, it's basically a 382 small block, uh, fully built uh, with the nitrous. Uh, I just put it uh, RPM T56 level six super magnum in it, and that thing is just like butter. Oh, just <laughs> ding 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 ding. Yeah, here, there's the glory right there. Yeah, you were moving. <laughs> oh, I was hitting it. I was hitting it. I saw I saw Bentley. I was like, okay. I was like, I'm gonna see what'll happen. I love the chirps too. Dum! I just oh. <laughs> man, I'm just a car guy. I yeah. love to have fun. It's, and uh, that, you that know, this incredible car. Yeah. You know, on the channel we always keep it under 70. So we yeah, you know, we we didn't do under we didn't yeah, do over we didn't, 70. We didn't break speed limit. We didn't. <laughs> never. Never. <laughs> Dude, this thing's nice though. <clears throat> I went and looked at one of these just because I thought it, I, I like the peanut butter and sides, but like, oh man, it's just, it's so much cheaper for so much faster. Oh yeah, but I mean, this, this is a fun car. In I mean, luxury. I can, I can jump in it, I can drive it across, across the country. country. Yeah, comfortably. I, I, I can do whatever I want to with exactly. it. Exactly. Um, although realistically, I think we're right there. We, we might be, uh, we might be trading it out for a Lambo. Really? What kind? Uh, Huracan. Huracan, there you go. Huracan's still something that because I daily drive my cars. <laughs> you daily uh, drive them? Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. I put 30,000 miles on that car in a year and a half. We're on our way to a charity toy drive, so I figure car toys are in order, right? Garage. Can't forget the girls. Don't forget the canned goods. Oh, we're losing cans. We're losing them. I think we got it in there. We're in the middle of this five or six hundred mile drive to Harrisburg, Pennsylvania. We left Indy to go here to Cops, Cars, and Coffee. It's a charity drive where those of us that have more are able to give back to those that are less fortunate. So we feel truly blessed to be able to do this and go meet with a bunch of other car guys. But I also wanted to take a minute to say thank you to my friends and my family for putting up with my crazy fantasies of making a YouTube channel and going and filming car content. This is something that I just love. My family, my wife, my kids are putting up with me, traveling all over the country, sometimes being home only a couple days at a time, and going out and doing crazy things all over the place. So I just wanted to make sure that I said thank you to all of you. When you see the hot now sign on, you absolutely have to stop the Krispy Kreme. How many? One each. So two? Two. <laughs> Sometimes you have to stop for a Krispy Kreme. Oh yeah.
Good night, or maybe I should say good morning, everyone. We've been driving well into the night, and it is late. We are tired. It is time to get a little bit of rest. And through the magic of editing, we are awake and we're on our way to the charity event with a trunk full of toys. And just as a little by the way, we've got a Gallardo. Hey, nice car, man. Oh, thanks, sir. We found ourselves a lost Gallardo owner trying to make it to the same event, so we got a little parade going. What's going on? Good morning. Did you did you drive like 600 miles or something like that? I did. Yeah, Mike showed me your post, and I was like, there's no way. Mike, We're nice here. to see you. We're here, and we've got a trunk full of toys. Thank you for coming. I greatly appreciate it. Trust me, the guy who the guy who I helped set this up, I set up the, the event, but he, he runs this for 15 years, and he helps the Pennsylvania State Police. Uh, so I, I thought, what, what way to help besides cops, cars, and coffee? And we, we organize it here. And again, thank you so much for driving out. Um, greatly appreciate it, dude. Seriously, can't thank you enough. So just do me a favor, just right down here. And uh, you see that tree where the Taurus is at? Got it. Okay, on the right side of it, take that first spot, all right? Thank you again. How we doing, Bentley? Good. My name's Sean. <laughs> have you ever been inside a Bentley? Say not yet. Well, you have today. Come on. Go ahead. You get to check out a Bentley, bud. <laughs> Go ahead. Just grab the door handle and climb right on in. This is your door. We just seen you down at Sheets. There you go. Go ahead. Get right inside there. Huh? You guys have the, like, the golf and the... Yeah. 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 All right, no, stay right there. I'll, I want you to do something for me. See the, see, see the pedal on this side? Yep. Push that as hard as you can. He was like, That's awesome, man. What do you think of that? We got Tyler over here. Tyler's a young car guy. He wanted to get a look at the Bentley, so we're going to put him inside, let him start it up. If you guys ever see me out at shows or events, don't hesitate to come up and say hello. We love to share with people. How do you start this? How do you start it? All right. The big square pedal. Put your foot on that, and then you're going to turn that to the right. Like this? Yep. Keep turning. There you go. Then you hit the other pedal really hard. What do you think? Let's do it. That's the go pedal, buddy. <laughs> what do you think of that, bud? Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> Ooh, ah. <laughs> that was like I dig the Gallardo, man. That's actually, uh, we're, we're talking about getting one. That might be my next yeah, purchase. Bring, so. Bringing up the classics. Man, she's pretty. It's one of my favorite colors. It's still early and certainly by no means has everybody arrived, but we've got this sick AMG GTS and a Performante Spider. Oh. My wife would have the AMG, because as we've learned, she loves AMGs, but the Performante would be mine. Hey everybody, check out Mike. He brought out the McLaren. He's got the teddy bear strapped to the top of it. And the Dirty Max. <laughs> oh, we got McLarens after McLarens. Hey folks, we're not the only ones that showed up with a trunk full of toys. Maybe we should do a little montage in this video of all the people that literally brought a trunk full of toys. Street Speed's got that Duramax packed full of toys. The V8 
V-Dub guys are making a good turnout. Wow. Oh, and they got the golf all wrapped. We got the golf Christmas present going over here. I think this might be a new kind of wrap we haven't seen before, but I love it. <laughs> Merry Christmas. Thank you. It is literally all of about 20 degrees out here, but he brought out the charger. That is loud. I don't know if you can even hear me right now, but it's loud, boys. It's loud. We got the American muscle rolling in. We don't discriminate. Everybody's turning out for a good cause. And Rudolph has made it. What's up, Mike? What's up? How you doing? Everybody needs a ski box. I really wish I had a ski box for the Bentley. Street speed's gonna help us get the Bentley unloaded. Got a bunch of toys and a bunch of canned goods. Alright, what are we putting in the, the, the okay. All of it. Everything's all going in. It's all for you guys. We did a bunch of car stuff, but we didn't forget the little girls too. Right? Without a doubt, it is never too late to show up in an Aventador SV. He certainly spec this thing right. We got a Roadster with the nice carbon wing and the carbon. We got carbon for days. Oh, the Alcantara. <clears throat> We've all seen Street Speed 720S, but who gets sick of looking at a 720? I love the interior on this thing. These things are sick. I've always thought it was a really cool touch putting the firing order on this Lambo V12. Probably completely unnecessary, but still a cool touch. Goodbye to our friend in the Lamborghini. We got the super clean Javelin on his way out. We had a lot of people come out to support this event with a lot of different cars. Pretty cool to see an old Javelin. We always love an American V8. You can't replicate that sound anywhere. That'll hurt your eardrums. We saw the dog dressed as Rudolph. We got the Corvette Grand Sport, Rudolph. <laughs> we got the 12C, sounding good. turbos wind up and wind back down that's a good sound there's no way we could leave this super clean swapped rabbit out of the video there was a lot of work that went into this thing and I cannot believe how clean it is wow. 
We've got another Bentley here. Another young man named Bentley. We got to let him sit in the Bentley and check it out. Go ahead, bud. Just go ahead and climb right on in. Yeah. And, uh, it's a car and it's meant to be shared with everybody. So jump inside and stand on that pedal on the right for just a second. No, on the right. There you go. Cool. Thanks a lot. Happy man. to be able to share with you, bud. Thanks, appreciate it. Go ahead and shake his hand, bud. When you Thank get you. older, work hard and get yourself something nice. If you own a McLaren, this is what you want it to sound like. Full send. This custom wrap ram sounds good and looks good. Before we go, we had to check out the thousand horsepower right. to the wheel spec V wagon. Fastest CTS wagon in the country. Down to me. Pretty much most of the crew is rolling out now. And we got the R8 rolling in late. Never, it's, it's never too late to come out. I was watching the weather, the weather looked a little funky. We love a, we love a clean R8. Oh, it's clean. Or a dirty R8, we love R8s. This event had a great turnout. So many people showed up and just packed this evidence truck full of toys. This is the way things are supposed to be when you throw an event for charity. Our charity event is over and we're on our way back to Michigan. We had a fantastic time, saw so many cool people and so many cool cars. I think it was well worth the 600 mile drive and it's something I would certainly do again. It's not so much that I want to, but when you have six liters and 12 cylinders, the people require it. You don't have a choice. You just have to. When you're entering a tunnel, you've got to let her rip. everyone, we are a few hundred miles into our drive back to Michigan. I'm assuming nothing else too terribly exciting is going to happen, so it might be a good time to end this video. We got the sun setting around us, it looks gorgeous. We're just going to enjoy the rest of the drive and uh, like I said, we'll just end the video here. Uh, thanks for watching and remember to hit that subscribe button. See you next video.